Hi traders, finally back to green. I'm over $25,000 in less than an hour, but I'm coming off three consecutive losing days. And tell you what, I was really praying I'm not going to have the fourth one. It was extremely hard to go through three consecutive losing days. It's, I mean, the last time it happened to me was years ago. Now, let me show you how it happened today, mainly with Tesla and Facebook. Tesla, as you can see here, started with a gap up. I love the daily of, of Tesla, and I'm going to show you that later. But it's a nice technical reversal here, and I'm going long here, 4,000 shares. And it did go over the highs, as I expected. I was looking for three points. I didn't quite get that. I'm up six thousand dollars right now seven eight thousand that's two points it's getting higher but it's finding some kind of resistance here and i'm a bit worried about the market direction too so i'll be quick about my partial taking my partial here and just took a nine thousand dollar trade or so now take a look at facebook that was my second trade i was extremely disappointed that facebook started by moving down as you can see the first three red candles these are one minute candles Facebook is moving down. Now, I love the daily of Facebook for a short. I posted it pre-market time, just like I did post uh, Tesla. And I just thought I'm going to miss this trade. But no, Facebook gave me a break. It finally moved higher. Now, when, when you go for a continuation, like a gap and go, you always need this pullback. This pullback is the one you're looking for. The thing that right now happen is where you will short the stock if it comes to the point where it gives you a nice technical formation and the buyers are out of the game. So I believe the buyers are out of the game. And I'm going to short now 8,000 shares because I really love that trade. So I'm short and I'm going to add a little bit more more as it will continue to move lower now there's two reasons for that one i love the daily of facebook and i'm going to show you that um, in a few in a few seconds and and, and the, the other fact is the market is coming down i love the direction of the market i mean we came down strong yesterday and i'm going to add now another 4,000 shares added just because it proved to me that it wants to continue lower now i'm hoping for a breakdown under the lows i have it that's a fast forward again i'm sure 12,000 shares $25,000 in profit taking my profit right now so that worked out great left 400 shares and as you can see after a small pullback it kept coming down and that's okay and coming to the point where i believe that it's likely to move higher just move to a new low i think it's a bit extended to the downside so i'm removing another 300 shares covering left just 100 and that was an amazing uh $25,000 trade now let's take a look at the daily here's the daily of facebook that's what happened today now i was watching facebook and i'm watching the market the market is coming down recently and i'm watching facebook and it's coming down even stronger now it it he it, it does have some some legal problems recently and you know the breakdown that recently happened uh to instagram and whatsapp and everything so uh facebook is coming down and i really love the daily that's a beautiful daily for a short and that's why it was my pre-market pick now take a look at uh, um at tesla Tesla, on the other hand, has a beautiful daily for a long. Now, at the beginning of the trading session today, I was not really sure about market direction. I mean, yesterday we came down and I was expecting it to continue. But at the beginning of the trading session today, the market was kind of moving higher. So anyway, I thought it was a good idea to go long Tesla. And that's a beautiful daily for a long. And that worked out as well. So I had a great day and I hope you enjoyed. And uh, please give us a thumb up if you did. And um, more than that, you know, I just want to talk a little bit about what happens if you're going through some really hard time trading. So I did. The last three days prior to this day were red. So how do you bounce back? One of the most important things you need to know about trading that every day is a new day. Now, that's not just in trading. It's like in life. If you carry on a very big weight of what happened to you recently and it doesn't matter if it's financial or other I mean your chance to bounce back is relatively very low you need to forget now it's unhuman I know but you need to forget the way to forget is just to convince yourself that every day is a new day and today has nothing to do with what happened yesterday or last week I had losing days but my day today is a new day and I know that I'm a good trader and I should bounce back. 
So I did bounce back today and I hope I'm, I'm going to keep trading the way I know how the way I trade in the past 21 years. I'm just I just hope I'm going to keep doing well in the next few days or the next few weeks. And it's likely to happen. That's that's reasonable to believe so. So I just have to put away the weight of what happened in the last few red days. And I just have to convince myself, you know, the best way to convince myself for me personally, I don't know if it works for you. I'm just really seriously talking to myself and I'm trying to convince myself that that's it. I mean, it happened, but it has nothing to do with today. Today is a new day. The sun is shining outside. I have new peaks and hopefully the market will go my way and the stocks will go my way. And I did uh, finish in a very nice green day. So thank you very much for watching this. Thank you for support. And again, if you like that, please smash that like button for us. And you can also subscribe to our trading room right here to our YouTube channel. And that's also our trading room because it's a live trading room. You can come in every day. You can come in every day and join us live in our trading room. And uh, don't forget the World Series of Day Trading is just about to be to start. You can join now. There's a link below and a short video that's coming right now to explain a little bit more about the World Series of Day Trading, the world's biggest trading competition. Thank you for watching. See you next time. The World Series of Day Trading returns for the sixth time, and this time the biggest prizes in history. Starting the 20th of October and lasting for six trading days. To take part in WSDT, you have to register and pass the verification process. It's your time to prove you deserve the most prestigious title in day trading. The best day traders on the planet gather to discover the new champion of the world. Trade a demo account for six days and prove you are the world's best trader. New to day trading? Don't worry about it. Whatever your level of experience, you're welcome to join. Win access to the biggest prize of all. It's time to prove that you are the next champion of the world. Register now to guarantee your seat.